Over the next three years, this land between Woodbine and Stanley Avenues will see new places to live specifically for those working entry-level jobs. Ranches and two-story homes will be available for purchase for those who make between 80 and 120 percent of the area's median income. The mayor says she and city council are enthusiastic about the effort, saying those who work in Portage should be able to live in Portage, especially as the city pays for more than a fifth of the Kalamazoo County housing millage. And we figured since Portage was contributing such a significant amount, we would like to see some of the housing built here in Portage. After neighbors disapproved of a larger project last year, the city is scaling back their plans for 78 houses to 44. And while those we spoke with along Woodbine Avenue are positive about the development, they're concerned about the traffic. During the new housing construction, the city plans to cut the number of lanes on Portage Road from four to three. One resident says it could make for a dangerous driving situation, especially from boat traffic from nearby Austin Lake. If the idea is to slow traffic down, I think there's a better way to do it than creating a bottleneck that just, you know, upsets people. The mayor responds that lower speeds will make for a safer community and says residents will have sidewalks and bike lanes to look forward to. It will be more of a family-oriented um, part of our community instead of a thoroughfare for people coming from Vicksburg and Schoolcraft that are just trying to get to Kalamazoo. With building costs skyrocketing, they don't have a firm idea of the final cost for home buyers, but they hope to have a dozen houses finished by next year. Now Portage will begin the long bidding process for infrastructure, with Mayor Randall saying it's now one of the city's top priorities. When it's your children looking for places to buy their first home or your parents that you want to keep in the community and keep it affordable, uh, I think there's a little bit of an incentive to buy into these programs. I'm Andy Gimignani. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, we've got much more to see. So take a second and subscribe to our channel.